And welcome back. Now, do you know how to how to find a fork? Yes, that's right. Console commands time again. Uh, let's see if I remember this. Now type in the code. Let's hope this works. Aha! This a fork. Is the man in black here again to introduce Columbia's program? I think we also need a hammer. I can't find one here. I guess I can just go back to Nova. We'll have to go back to Nova anyway, so. Yeah, I definitely have one in my safe. Yeah, let's, let's just go back. If you've been with us on these Tuesday nights, you will know that suspense is compounded with mystery and suspicion and dangerous adventure. Yeah, I like this quest. I like how the safe is right, pretty much right next to my house, so I can just, just within walking distance anyways. So I head back to my room. And so, it is with... The Devil's Saint and Mr. Peter Laurie's performance. I should have like a pretty big stack of hammers saint. in the walker. The Devil's Saint. Yep, over here. Paris. As you can see, I've been collecting a whole bunch of crafting components. Mm. Ah, looks like Edie sort of when light bugged out. From the old to the hill of yeah, sometimes uh, my companions actually sort of glitch out and get stuck on the furniture. I think once they, uh, one of them managed to knock down all those cartons of cigarette I had put there on that shelf, which really made me rage. And especially when, when it takes ages to actually decorate your room like that. The mosaic decorations are no less bright than the colours that weave here. Alecrins and Columbines, so, Cleopatra we're looking and for in the great marble foyer, remember it? So called Kyoto's of Topin, oh we need a paint gun as well. We might have one of them. Ah, I'll move it away. What are they doing? A wearing the scarlet and gold uniform of an English guard officer in Wellington. Veronica, you're taking up all the space in the big power armor. And as we approach... Yes, John, please, you must be wired off. You really don't mind, do you? No, of course I don't mind, only you must. Well, this one's easier than the one before, I guess. We've got to settle this thing. You have enjoyed being here tonight, haven't you? Ned, I've loved it. After being cooped up at my uncle's place in the yep, country, we have three it's like All right. When I take you back to the hotel, I'm going to face this uncle of yours tonight. No. So let's no, craft I'm going to say that one you and I intend to get married in that dress. I can't marry you, Ned. I've told you that. But why not? Just give me one good reason. Because I can't. Where is it? Gear lizard token. You would over never here. allow it. Never. And that seems to you a good reason enough. I'm pretty sure we already yes. got one before, though. This uncle of yours. Uh, what Did we mean? just like enter no, the He's a Hungarian, the thing wrong or something? Yes, so am I. No My idea. Was an American. Well, what's he like actually? Oh, he's a little eccentric. Well, please don't yeah, I think we were just doing he's something wrong. And a historian, only he's a little strange. He, Ned, what is it? There he is now. It mean, doesn't, doesn't oh, let yes. me type that in that MNR. So I don't know what it wants. I see him. Oh, he looks as black Let's as try again. Ah, right, now it's letting us. M. N. R. What? Good evening, Ilona. Good evening, Uncle Stefan. Is that just the wrong Uncle. one? May I present Edward Whiteford? How do you do, sir? How do you do? Maybe, you know, maybe I entered the wrong one. The thing to wear in public? Why not? Well, I'm well, pretty I sure it's right. Modest, it looks like. yeah, Actually, it might be. Nothing. Will you go and get your cloak or your domino or whatever you yeah. wore here? Uncle, please. Oh, I have no idea. So I'm pretty sure it's the style it's that I'm getting wrong. I was not asking you Unless to I can't home, count I was as well. Asking you to put on a wrap. All right, I'll get it. You stay and talk to me. I shall be delighted. Will you sit down, sir? Uh, Thank so you. <laughs> you seem to have yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just like table. <laughs> yes. The friends of mine from the embassy there. Little trapezium type thing. Well, <laughs> look, 
Gases, gases, and still more gases. <laughs> you know, I was quite an addict once with the uh, mystery gases. You ever tried it, young man? <laughs> oh, it's so easy. You take a spoon like this, you see, and... <laughs> well, it might be like H. It. Oh, forgive me, sir, but there's something I'd like to ask you. Yes? Well, I don't know exactly how to say this, so I'd better say it in the shortest way. I want to marry Let's make sure I've got these the right. Yeah, this should be up. right. A few francs will pay for that. But there are other things of higher value. I guess I'll just try well, every single one. My full name is Lord Edward Whiteford. My father's the Earl of Grey. Indeed. <laughs> so I only mentioned that to show uh -huh. that. Apparently that was the right one. Enough, the British ambassador so yeah, we have like two gears now. I ought to mention that... Uh, I've always kept Ilona carefully guarded. This was head back to Novak. Almost too carefully guarded, don't you see? That's Lord Edward depends so on where's the house? Reason. From here. Hunter? Yeah, let's just head back to Novak. Uh, about how long? Four days. Four days. You wouldn't even choose a business partner in four days. So yeah, that's Yet to want to marry not, not too bad. After four days. I guess. But we know our own mind, sir. You do, huh? And you know more than the all the way back the there. Yeah, I'm kind of curious However, to meet this guy. We've sort of built it up I hope it is, Harry. quite Did well, actually. It oh, made no, you sir. want to carry on. Well, I will make you a proposition. <laughs> I own an estate in Turin, not far yeah, from Paris. Yeah, we actually go to meet this guy in person this time. So let's hope this works. I know, no, no, oh, me. Oh, she did. Well, then Two minutes later, the day. vacuum system when activates. Convene oh, oh, contents to your mysterious <laughs> employer. And uh, if at the end uh -huh. of that time, you're not Whoa. Of just suddenly. Ah, right, I think it actually waits an hour no? in real time. Well, if at the end of that time, you're not cured uh, permanently of this feeling, would you kindly you take it on? And with my blessing. Just wait till it's. Wait until the morning. Then we'll have a read of that note. You see, at the Chateau d'Ave, there is one certain bedroom we call it the So let's see what it says. Well, uh, I assure you, it'll be. Knew before I opened the safe that you'd deliver the gears. Hi, is it haunted or something? No, 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 not haunted. <laughs> Um, yeah, he's going to report the air and repair the elevator and down, so... Lift should carry you to my front door. Hmm. This is it. We actually get to meet him. Let's see if it actually works, though. Aha! This is quite cool. You know, there's no button to press or anything, you just, you just walk on and it works. Yeah, really nicely done. Let's just take all this stuff. Ah, that's the safe that's connected to the one below. Yeah, this is a pretty well made model. That's his house. It's quite nice. I'm just gonna have a look around. What was he saying? I couldn't hear. Hello, no, I couldn't be better. But he's a very decent old boy, actually, and he's invited me to the Chateau Gazé. Did he say anything about the tapestry room? Yes. Look at that. Yeah, he wasn't. He wasn't lying about the views. Pretty. Pretty good. From up here. Because everybody who sleeps in that room dies. Hey, yeah, let's go meet this guy now. House of the Chef. I'm excited. This isn't a superstition, Ned. It happened once when I was a little girl. A man insisted on sleeping there. They found him dead in the morning. Hmm. No touching. They don't know. Oh. It's a Ruger Mini 14. Fine. I won't touch it. I guess we'll take this though. Another note. A teddy bear on the chair. Is that guy even here? The chef person. I can hear like faint music in the background. Toilet paper. 
Yeah, no, I've just realised there is no toilet paper in Fallout New Vegas. He's pretty much the only one. He's got like the last two rolls of toilet paper, which I just took. It can bring little comfort to a young man. Or maybe his toilet paper is made in house. Along snake-like roads. This is kind of like Dr. Mitchell's house, I think. Oh, you don't actually get to meet the chef. Oh. He just, he just gives you more clues. Look at that, it's him. Yeah, he has a daughter as well, I think. There's some books. The Holy Bible. Why do you cross yourself? If I, am I would think that Bibles are actually quite Only common. I mean, you go I to church and there's literally rows and rows of Bibles put on, uh, on the pews. Dogs, dogs. Uh, he's left well, a note here. here no bark. I don't know, that name rings a bell for me, but I don't know what it is. I definitely do remember it. I've heard of it before. He's designed a two-headed bear for the NCR. Ah, uh, this guy. There isn't a bell on this door, there might at least be a knocker. This guy apparently designed the NCR's emblem. For three caps. <laughs> yeah, that, that was apparently the, the picture he, he, he made. Yeah, are you... Actually, to be honest, I don't think I could do better. I mean, I, I was going to diss him, but judging from my own experience, yeah. That would be really hypocritical of me. What's this? Oh. Pretty cool, there's a lot of detail to this place. Whoa. Whoa, I didn't even notice that the first time round. Oh man, that's the chef there. Oh, he's got some unique clothing as well, tuxedo hat. That's pretty cool, I have to say. It looks like he poisoned himself. One task remains. Let's have a look. Yeah, I'm going to have a look around this first. Oh, that no, actually made that. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Welcome to the Chateau de Vie. Thank you, Captain Harry. Oh, you must be very wet Oops. after your long drive. Another one here. To the pie and warm Look at that. Uh, Madame Faye. Yes. I love the attention to detail they've put here. I wonder where his daughter's mm. gone. Tapestry room, that is what I said, Madame Yeah, there's some Faye. doors that yes. you can't open. Oh my goodness. So many toys. This is not good, my friend. This is against my advice. A roller skate as well? Yeah, this is really cool. They've added... You can actually pick up this toy box this time. It is the wrong season of the moon. Uh, the wrong moon. <laughs> but there is no moon tonight. It's raining cats and dogs. Oh my god, this mod is so well done. It is the wrong season of the moon. I say no Oh more. no. The star cap glitched through. How about we responsible if they make you do it? But Let's take that anyway. What did happen to the last bloke who slept in the tent? Yeah, I don't know what happened to his kid. He was a very saintly gentleman. Maybe we'll have to go find her or something. It was some time ago when the loner was only 15 years old, but... Let's have just look around some more. This is a pretty cool place. The church, said our bishop. Has no use Very for easy law. Well, <laughs> he insisted on sleeping there. I, I made it as comfortable for him as possible, but uh, just he a was store room. next morning with a crucifix still in his hand. Was it poison? There was no poison, mm. Monsieur. Better no. drink. <laughs> Here, Dr. Solomon. It's true. 
Round the air wedges, two bells. Nope, didn't want to jump first. You see, in uh, connection with that bell, on a mantelpiece, there was found burning a stick of incense. Ordinary incense, nothing wrong. So, picked up some goodies there. And uh, under the dressing table, the police found it with an empty jar of ointment. Now, here you wait. Uh, well, the oven doesn't look all that different from a normil one. Special egg timer? I wonder what that does. Actually, I think we should actually read the note first. He had a very old family, Lord Edward. Old and perhaps a curse. When man yeah, I don't know what this is. Should I, be, should I be reading this one first or that one? Surely they brought certain beliefs with them. The old religion. The old religion? Hmm. Yes, the cult of Diana. The cult of Janus. The cult of freedom and fertility. The turning point of what caused you to. Oh, now look here, sir. Must we talk about this? Well, you smile, but, uh. When I say the word witch, you think of some humorous picture on a Halloween card. Brahmin dog. It was very different in the Middle Ages, believe me. Then, my friend, there existed an Ah, so that pretty much religion, tells you what happened. Which rivaled the church. There were many to You know, how he managed to get that sort of safe Catholic. delivery system. Many to receive all favors from Satan, their master. And today, ah, forever, well, we actually read one of his, his terminal, I think, to find out what happened. Some 200 years ago, an ancestress of mine, Katerina Kohari, was tortured Yeah, blessed death. reunion with his family, so I assume that they've all passed away. Many persons have not thought it safe to sleep their things. Are you anxious? Oh, come, sir. Uh, some kind of an average joke. Joke? The Bishop of Tours did not find it a joke. Isn't Harriet his daughter? I assure you as a physician. Oh, no, he killed her. mark on his body. <laughs> no, not a mark on his body. <laughs> he a Dr. Solomon. Yes, I did. Well, understand me, Lord Edward, there's no compulsion in this. Drag his body to the door. I wonder if that actually works. I guess we read the terminal first, though. never. Would you like me I mean, to yeah, usually I just sort of skip sure through this stuff, but this is pretty... I mean, this stuff's pretty interesting. I mean, they've really done a good job of really getting you engaged with the story. What this thing does, though. Huh. So pretty much tells us that we've unlocked three. For the love of heaven, don't do it! Yeah, three recipes. Yeah, I wonder if we're actually literally meant, uh, meant to drag his body towards the door. So let's read his terminal first. In the north tower of the Chateau de Zay, under the conical slate roof, is a circular room hung with faded tapestries. Love how the rolling pin's actually a weapon. Mimic life to the clamor of the storm outside. Candles burn along the mantelpiece and beside the great four-poster bed. The um, flames of these candles waver too as the door opens. Yeah, I think that might be it for loot. This is the tapestry room, Monsieur. Thank you, Madame Fleck. That is the mantelpiece where the incense burns. That is the bed where Monsignor the Bishop died. Very inviting, isn't Daddy shows Gekko to his boss. Oh, that's so cute. And the tree, the Oh, no, thanks. Well, I had a drink with the Count Harry before I came upstairs. Mm. Leaving Neptune. Uh, Monsieur, shaving water will be brought up in the morning. If he requires it. Yeah, everyone seems to hate Neptune. I mean, I guess it's quite fortunate for him that he got away quickly enough before the Legion turned up. What's that? Oh wow, this is actually a lot of reading. Galona. May I come in? No, Lona. Get out of here. That's not very gallant of you. No, I mean, I, I don't want you exposed to whatever it is. Uh... Are you going to bed? Or are you going to sit up all night? 
I'm going to sit up all night naturally. I just want to find out, like, how he died or why he killed himself. No. If that was the case. Why not? Oh, it's dangerous. Besides, I promised your uncle I'd go through with it alone. I wish you hadn't had that break with him. Why? He could have uh, done anything to it. It was you who pulled Yeah, he's been rambling yes, quite a lot. Only... Fame of Eden. All of these entries. Where's it coming from? Even right here that's the behind. Yeah, so he moved to Novak from Neptune. Get behind that tapestry alone. Quick. Hide there. Come from Harry. Where did you come from? Oh, forgive me, Lord Edward, for seeming to appear out of the wall and between a tapestry. <laughs> Like so he's just thought, sort of huh? describing his father. And his red dressing gown perhaps adds to the effect too. <laughs> How'd you get here? A uh, passage between the walls? Yes, exactly. Yeah, so he's so witnessed a lot of killing when he was a kid, I guess. You know, they invented that when its occupants were too unmanly as to bolt the door. The door's not bolted, you could have walked straight in. But I couldn't have done it unobserved. No, maybe not. Uh, have you had any other visitors? No. Are you quite sure of that? Quite sure. Well, because they had since nobody told me come here. A choice. I'll just sit down by the fire. <laughs> Please sit up with me. Is this the showdown, sir? Hmm? I don't understand. Well, there's got to be a showdown between us. Is that why you're here? Oh, I'm here, young man, to explain certain things. I'm sorry I'm not talking much, but I'm actually pretty engaged with Thank this you. reading. Oh. It's pretty cool. <laughs> That is what you're afraid of? I'll have one yet. A light? Let's go. Well, when I was discussing the witch cult a while ago, you didn't appear to... Yeah, I don't know why. This sex. character is actually... Do you want a perfectly frank answer to that? I actually yeah. feel the most engaged I with this character so far in the whole game. <laughs> as of yet. <laughs> he what has a lot of backstory to him. True. I've seen an old and uh, inbred family like ours. The man can crack in a fantasy of witchcraft, become as real, well, more real than the living world. Let me give you an example. Go on. The saucer on the table beside you mm. is Min Porson. It was once owned by Katarina Kohari, a martyr of the old religion. Yet, you are using it as an ashtray. Oh, I beg you, which lady's pardon? I'll blow off the ash. Well, that's a very dangerous remark, sir. Don't you understand that the worship of evil... I mean, feel free to skip this if you're not that interested, but... That the devil can have his I don't know, I am. ...that the sick brain which knows but can't help itself, you have profaned this room merely by entering it. And therefore, you deserve to die. Huh. Like the Bishop of Tours? Exactly. You're not going to tell me the devil killed him. The devil's agent may be flesh and blood. Then it was murder. Oh, of course it was murder. Murder, so cunningly contrived that no one ever so, saw So, yeah, he actually got lucky and managed to get us. On his problem. Well, managed, uh, managed to actually own this house. was burned in this room. Do you know why? Suppose you tell me. Well, obviously, I think to conceal something else, which would be too easily noticed. <laughs> People actually tried to climb up the cliff to get to the house. First one, yeah, first one to actually make it up there gets it. Using chloroform this afternoon to dispose of some dogs. So I said, well, Dr. Solomon is old and uh, very forgetful. You mean chloroform to be stolen? Oh, yes, it could be easily. Now, suppose, I mean, just suppose I take a pair yeah, so, so I think that's how he managed to fix the safe, is he actually, he's actually like a really well-educated person compared to... A lot of the people Wait. in New Vegas. That, that won't do. Why not? Chloroform burns and blisters when it touches the skin. You leave marks. Oh, not at all, my friend. Not at all. If I first covered the mouth and nostrils with some substance like... Uh, yeah, he just yeah. fixed the elevator. Up. Which is which now was apparently really easy for him. In a few seconds, unconsciousness. In two minutes or three minutes. Oh, but chloroform, you see. <laughs> it evaporates huh. very quickly. There is no trace in the stomach. 
Two more, two more journal entries. Yeah, so Harriet is her daughter, maybe. I think he adopted her. No, I'm not sure. There's one thing you're forgetting. I'm not sleeping and I'm not drugged. Oh, yes, you are. How? When? Mm. In the cigarette? Hmm? No. In a drink you had with me. But yeah, he's he's a, he adopted her. Well, you've had enough to put three men to sleep. And I guess he sort <laughs> of wanted to find out well, what actually to happened to parents. Actually, I think. I think they were killed and then he adopted her because of that. You have been in a fire yourself if I hadn't caught Take your hand off me. Last one. If I could wish that helpful. Well, but you can. Well, better sit down again. Murdering them. So I still don't know how he died. One night. Who, I? You don't think I killed the bishop of Tour, didn't you? You fool. I'm not trying to kill you. I'm trying to save you. Dr. Solomon. Yes, well, come out, come out, come in the room. Come out and be my witness. Yes, monsieur. I shall always guard the family honor. Oh, Even wow. That's, yeah, I sort of, I sort of saw, saw that coming. About myself. As soon Am as he I mentioned that super daddy thing, you know, insane? leap from a car, yes. that's not a good thing to... Yes. Yeah, she got ideas. <laughs> that's actually have you quite... Any notion, Lord Edward? I thought you were quite sad, but I don't know, kind of, never have believed me if I had merely kind of far-fetched in a way that it actually happened. Show, show me what? What? <laughs> look, look at the tapestry. Come out of there. Come out of there. Hey, come out. Yeah, if only he didn't yes. make up the story yes, about Super Elona. Daddy. Why do you think I've kept Elona so well guarded from the world? Why, at a fancy dress ball, for instance, did I object to the costume of a medieval witch? Yeah, I guess he sort of... Whose were poisoned? So it chloroformed... I guess he committed brought. suicide after Who that. Who poured the drink? Drunk with morphine? In the devil's name, what are you trying to tell me? Wait, 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 what, why did he... Is that why he had to take the pylon down? I have to, I have to re read this. Oh, he wants to like remove like. Huh. I don't know. Apparently, it meant it meant a lot to him that he got that pile removed. So I guess we've done a good deed, in a way. And so closes. I wonder if he literally just drag his corpse over to the door. I wonder if that actually works. That does anything. Yeah, so I think he. It was, it was evident that he poisoned himself. Yeah, as I said before, I'm really sorry if this turns out to be a really boring episode for you guys to watch. Nearly empty. Yeah, he, he drank the whole thing. Mother Darkness. I think that was how Bradley died as well. He had the same poison. This is weird. Well, I wonder if this is actually producer, gonna work. John Deep, the director, Bernard Herman, the composer conductor, oh, you need a shovel. and John Dixon Carr, right. the author, are collaborators on I think we saw a shovel outside. Yeah, we'll just, we'll take the shovel from outside and bring it back. Yeah, let's just do this last thing for him. Uh, where's the shovel? Here it is. Yeah, that's Harriet's grave. Even if we were given the option to dig her up, I'd, nah, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that to them. So yeah, this is the end for the chef. Dig up a small box. What's in this box? Ah, there's that. Ah, there's a room key. 
Now we can actually go inside all those locked doors, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I, I really like this mod, I mean, I think the fact that there are no quest markers just sort of makes this all the more, all the more interesting. So tempted to take this, this Ruger Mini 14 though. I think that might have been added in by the mod. Well, let's take it anyways. So there, we can actually go inside most of these rooms now. Look at this. I wonder what he's got here. Water purifier switch. Oh, but I think this place, I think you can actually use this place as your own house. That's really cool. Morrison's memoirs. Perk obtained. We got a new perk. Aha, uh -huh. you may want to return to the Good Spring Saloon and see if there's another note, so... Yeah, that would start the second part of this quest. Which is pretty cool. Yeah, I really like this. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can actually use this as your own house. It's quite a nice house in itself. I still prefer my Novak room down below. But this is quite nice. Hope I can kill a legionary today. Look at that. A custom made speaker system. A tool cabinet. Actually, let's see what's here. I think there's another room we can unlock. What's this? Transfers all items in your inventory. Ah, that's quite convenient actually. Now let's not do that though. Yeah, they've put a lot of work into this mod, I can tell. Now that Mr. Higginbottom has been put to rest, the house needs a name. House of a Chef. Harriet's house, Morrison's Manor. I have no idea. I do not know. They're all pretty good. Guess we'll go with. House of a Chef. Actually, Morrison's Manor would be a more homely name. Yeah, House of a Chef just seems kind of generic now that I think about it. Ah oh well. Yeah, I think that's actually all the rooms we've explored. There might have been one more. Or is that it? No, I think that is it. But yeah, quite a little house as well you get just for playing this, playing through this mission. So yeah, pretty well done. So I think that does it for this part of the playthrough. I hope you enjoyed it. I actually really enjoyed that. I mean, the stuff we were doing wasn't particularly exciting. You know, not a lot, not a ridiculous amount of combat or anything, but yeah, it's quite story wise, it's probably one of the best mods I've played through so far. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Although there is a little weird weird basket on the roof there. Let's try and let's try and jump on the roof. No, I don't know. I don't know if that's even possible, right? See you guys next time. Bye.